As record heat continues across central Texas, more people turn to their ACs to cool down. How, though, is that affecting the Texas energy grid? And could we see some blackouts? Nabil Ramadna shows us how renewable energy is keeping the lights on. It's hot out there, so when the temperatures are on the rise, many people turn their AC way down. We, you know, hit a new record, you know, this summer, I think, uh, hitting over 75 gigawatts um, just a few days ago. That's why energy companies will ask you to set your AC to 78 degrees and try not to use appliances during peak hours. Conserving energy can help prevent blackouts, but with a summer heat wave, that can be a hard ask. These extreme heat temperatures are um, you know, really straining the grid and testing its ability to, to meet all the demands that we have right now. So far, no blackouts. And according to Luke Metzger with Environment Texas, renewable energy is helping make sure we don't see any. Wind and solar are playing a critical role in, in keeping the lights on and the, the AC running. Without wind and solar, we would definitely be having blackouts. Um, today, it's expected that wind and solar will provide about 30% of our peak demand of energy. Um, you know, some days, you know, it's as high as 40 or 50%. But are there concerns by turning to wind and solar energy? The biggest concern you hear is uh, around its intermittency. It's true that it, the sun doesn't always shine, the wind doesn't always blow, and that's why we need a, a balanced mix of uh, clean energy sources. But as more people move to Texas and temperatures keep rising, something will have to change, says Metzger. And we know that's only going to get worse and, and, uh, unless we take action to uh, you know, weatherize our homes, put in more insulation, use more efficient appliances. Metzger says one of the problems right now with wind and solar is we're producing a lot in West Texas and South Texas, but we don't have enough transmission capacity to actually bring the wind and solar to our cities. All right. So, so keep your AC low. That's kind of okay. 78 when you're not at home. That's that's the ask. Is that possible? My dad does it, and okay. I told him he's got to bring a fan in next time I come because <laughs> it's still pretty hot. All right. I got to take some notes from dad, though. All right, Neville, thanks so much.